after just a few months with this amazing man, I noticed Nathan had a talent for helping men understand women. Witnessing Nathan settle many a lover's spat. <laughs> oh, please. I, what? I need background. But you're giving way too much of it. Well, and remember the editor wanted this in Q&A form. The wife asking Manlanders in a fun, adorable way what he would do in this or that situation. That's why I'm here, to give you the answers. Well, and, uh, you know, adding too many details about how Ask Manlanders came to be might trip us up later. Plus, you'll face a lot of questions afterwards you may not be able to answer. I can answer any questions they throw at me, but I do think you are right. Mac's one of your biggest fans. We don't want him asking too many questions. Exactly. Okay, how do we demonstrate our love for the readers? How do we shine a spotlight on the fact that I inspired you to become Ask Man Landers? What's it like being married to Ask Man Landers? Nathan West sat down with his wife to answer the questions his fans want to know. There, done. Wait, what? You barely said anything about me. Uh, we us. can uh, add more later, right? So what's our first question? Here? Ooh, ooh, I've been thinking about this. Um, when are flowers not enough? And then we can talk about that time that you surprised me on Valentine's Day. Yeah, Max, I don't, I don't know if that's gonna work. The guys that write in here don't really ask questions like that. Yeah, but don't guys like really stress about giving their girlfriends appropriate gifts? How about, uh, why does a woman tell me not to bring anything to a party and then get mad when I show up empty handed? <laughs> yeah, no, that's that's great. See, I, I've had that conversation. What? Everybody knows you bring something regardless of what a hostess says. Not really. It's just the sort of thing my readers want to be told. Maybe, maybe throw something in there about how it doesn't have to be a bottle of wine. You just bring like a cool beer for everybody to try. <laughs> That's great. It, it can be intimidating picking out wine if it's not your thing. Yeah, well, it's like you said in the uh, last interview, you know, do what, uh, do what feels comfortable, not just what you think your girl wants. Sincerity is always the way to go. Enough. Stop right now. Whose article is this anyway? Maxie, 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 come on. Come on. It, it's totally your article, okay? And you're right. The fans want to know about Ask Man Landers and his wife. We just need Damie's help for the Ask Man Landers part. <sighs> hey, hey, hey. Nina's going to love the article. Don't even worry. And look at the pictures that Cliff sent for your approval. That's nice. Mm hmm? That one's kind of cute. Mm hmm. Oh, I love that one. That's it. Ten questions, ten answers. I'm all done here. Fortunately, I still have time to try to call Chet one more time on my way to GH for my real job. Oh, yes, let's hope you reach your brother since he is the reason we are all working so hard to keep this Ask Manlander secret. Yes. If this is about anyone, it's about my brother. Uh, uh, hey, Amy, hey, uh, thanks for coming over. Yeah, I hope Chet's okay. Thanks, Nathan. Well, it's done, and you are gonna look so gorgeous in this article that I'm gonna have to be fighting guys off to keep you with me. Oh, no, I only have eyes for you. I'm back at you. I'm gonna go take a shower. Ooh, maybe I'll join you in a minute. Mm -hmm. hmm. Gotta see what she wrote. No, this just won't do. I'm gonna have to punch it up a little. <laughs> 